All right, we're on a after hours call here. We've got the outdoor condenser, it's not working. And according to our core sense, we're getting the red trip locked light here blinking. Two, three, four. It's like four flashes. One, two, three, four. So we'll go up here to our chart. See right here, red lock, flash code four. Yellow is off, which it is. Locked rotor, compressor's locked out at 10 consecutive locked rotor events. And here's what it could be. So we'll start with the capacitor. And we got the disconnect off. Pull our wires off and check the cap. Okay, we got our wires removed. Let's clamp one lead on our common. And then we'll clamp the other on our Herm. And we should be getting around 30 microfarads. You can see we're getting zero. All right, let's check the fan side. Getting zero there as well. All right, got another cap with me. We'll take it out and test it and throw it in, see what happens. Okay, there's our new one, and we're getting 30.4. All right, there's our fan side, and we're getting 5.0. So let's remove this old cap, throw in the new one. Okay, our yellow goes to Herm, which is our compressor. Brown is our fan, goes to the single terminal. And then the purple and the red is our common, which goes to the C terminal that has four terminals. Okay, and I reset the core sense. See the light's not blinking anymore by basically just killing the power to it. So now we'll plug the disconnect back in and go in, turn the thermostat on, and it should fire up. Okay, our thermostat's back on. Let's put our disconnect back in. Heard a compressor fire. There we go, we got our solid yellow light on run, which is good. All right, the unit's been running for about 10 minutes. Got my initials and date of the cap, and we got the stub gauge on. You can see we're a little over 115 PSI there on the suction side, so to say this thing's not low. It's only about 67 degrees out, so never was an issue with it not cooling properly until today when it stopped working, obviously because of the cap. So 
just a little quick check of the charge make sure it's not low and that, that's it for this one all right thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one